Okay, this is the south overhead door opener. Okay, and we got a clothes dryer here. It's three prong electric, it's not GFCI. Yeah, we got a little bit of wood rod in here on our ship lap, right in there. We got some details, see some good daylight coming through here because we don't have building paper. We got an OSB for the roof, but we're talking about the door opener. So, and one thing I don't have, one thing I'm looking for, is I do not have a control button inside for the door opener. You got the emergency release, and that's why the door is halfway open. Okay, so that gives us a good starting point. The door is halfway open, and it tells us that the spring is properly adjusted. So we're going to come up here. I guess I got to do it right. Always helps if you do it right. And we just move right on along here. And we redo the gizmo. Short men develop skills. So is that hooked up? Okay, we do not have, I might as well use this. We do not have optic sensors within six inches of the floor. That would be those up there. All right, we've bypassed the optic sensors. Now, what we've got here is we do not have a manual door lock inside, which is a good thing, all right? We do not have a pull handle inside. We do not have a pull handle outside. Let's see, what else have we got? We do not have a protective cover, a lens diffuser to protect these light bulbs. Okay, that's missing. So, Dollars and Donuts is not GFCI protected. There, there's a receptacle up there, which again is a good thing. So, could I get you to close the door for a moment? Absolutely. This is what we do, and our emergency reverse works. Now, I did not do a block test. Okay, it's in my inspection agreement. In my inspection agreement, that's posted on my website. I do not I made a business decision to do no harm, so I do not do block tests. I have baked inside of your inspection report instructions on how to do a block test. So if you want to get together with the listing agent or whatever and get a block test handled, man, that's totally up to you. I've got instructions in the report. I got links on how to do a block test. This is what I do. This is what I did. So we do have, at least have that. So let's review. No GFCI. No prism cover. Optic sensors are too high from the floor. Do not have warning notices posted inside the door. Do not have spring tension notices on each corner of the door.